good YouTube, Mega here, back with yet another Evo vs. video. Today we're going to be covering the migration delay, the new farm contract set to come here soon, and some tips and tricks I've found uh, and things to avoid uh, in regards to this migration and the LP farms that we are in. Um, as always, I want to let you know, none of this, none of my opinions are financial advice. This is not financial advice. I highly suggest you to do your own research um, and make your own investment decisions. This is solely my opinions and my opinions only. Um, and as always, if you enjoyed today's video, leave a like um, and also subscribe to the channel. We're trying to reach 50 subscribers about halfway there. Um, and if there's anything else you wanted me to cover in the Evo versus space or DeFi space, comment down below. I'd love to hear. Um, now let's get into the price here um, of Evo. It is April 30th today, about noon Eastern, where I am. And the price is a little under $0.05. Cents. We fell into the $0.04 cent range. Um, uh, previous highs we were looking at last video about mid-5. So we have fell a little bit um, under 20% down here. But as for those who are looking to get into these LP farms, it's a great buying opportunity. Um, now, of course, do your own research, not financial advice as always, but this is a great spot for you to hop in these LP farms and take advantage of these high APRs. The The emissions are still running. The new contract is not up yet. So if you are looking to get in, you are still able to deposit in the old contract, and you'll still be able to go about entering the new farm contract once that's available. That's going to be our next topic here that we're going to jump into here. We'll go to the Discord, Evo versus Discord. Now, as you can see here, 428. Um, this was the article medium document here that they uploaded um, in order to get you ready for the migration. Come yesterday, 429, about 221 p.m., Alivo posts this. And after reflecting on our launch this last week, we realized that we weren't live before we were Excuse me. We realized that we went live before we were ready. We paid the price, but more importantly, you all paid the price. We feel it's important now that we check, double check, and triple check everything to ensure a smooth migration. I agree. Everything should be fully ready before it's implemented. This is a great uh, idea by Alivo here. They are currently in the process of completing tests and will be delaying the launch until testing is completed. So getting back to what I said, new farm contract is not just yet out. Not out just yet. Um, your safety is their priority, so they want to ensure that the contracts are fully battle-tested, and we would prefer to delay slightly rather than publishing anything that they did not have 100% confidence in. I'm completely down with that. They made a promise to us last time, and they intend to keep it. They'll be auditing, reviewing, and testing everything to avoid any further issues. Let's make this rocket, So, which is awesome. Um, I'm fully on board with this. If it's not ready, it's not ready. And you definitely, with anything in tech, DeFi especially, crypto especially, you should know if you've been in this space any any bit longer than like a month or so, that timelines change, tech especially um, is finicky, and things can work one day, and then you have a bug the next that might cause a few issues. So um, this is fine by me. Gives us more time to load up in the LP farms and, and take advantage of this price, actually, which is pretty good. Um, and then here's Gilgamesh today at 4.51 a.m. with an update. Just wanted to follow up. We'll make sure to post a more detailed announcement on roadmap plan for the next few days and ETA on contract migration later today. So we look, we should look forward to that today, April 30th. Garden emissions are still running. So this is getting to, um, and, and this is the document that uh, was posted for 28 to get in, get you guys ready here for the migration. But I want to get into a tip here that I came across, uh, something to avoid doing if you are looking to await <laughs> that new contract. Sorry for the dog there. Now, um, as you can see, I'm here in Evo Versus. Um, I do still have my LP farmed as of now. But last night, I got on late, was kind of out of the loop all day, so I didn't know what to do. I should have looked in the Discord and just asked around first, but I did withdraw my LP thinking that the new contract was live, and I wanted to get um, into the new contract for the day one emissions. This was a mistake on my end. As you can see here, I lost about, I didn't lose, but the 25% withdrawal fee did go in intact there, and I lost about 1,200 or so LP tokens. Um, and I redeposited whatever I had remaining. Now, this was a mistake on my end because now I don't have that full 
LP farm um, giving me emissions. I could still have about 5,000 in here, but I withdrew thinking that the new farm contract was available. Uh, this is me telling you guys to avoid doing that until the announcement is out from the team. Um, I should have done it. I don't know why I was, it, it was late at night and I just, I, I really wanted to take advantage of the day one emissions. So I was like, let's claim, let's withdraw, hurry up and get into the new farm um, before you miss out. And I was way off the mark there. Um, so what you want to do is avoid withdrawing from your LP until the Discord, the team up, updates us in the Discord. They'll always post in the announcement, so just keep a, keep an eye out for that. Um, as you can see, we're still getting emissions here. Um, still fairly high APRs. The APRs have hiked up since last video. We are about 4,300. We're sitting at almost 5,100% now today. And as more people, I don't know if it's withdrawing or or what the case exactly is, but these APRs have been increasing. And I'm completely content with, as you can see, redepositing my LP and um, um, awaiting the actual new farm contract. Um, now, of course, like I like I just mentioned, the reason I did withdraw was because I'm trying. I was trying to take advantage of those day one. Um, emissions. So basically, when they reset this farm contract, they are going to reset it as if we were on day one, um, epic one, of the emissions. So that's going to be the full. I believe it was, two fifty Evo or something along that line per block. So absolutely outstanding APRs when that new farm contract is launched. I'm going to try to keep you guys updated, whether it be on Twitter, and I'll leave, of course leave that that link down below in the description so you can follow me and, and get alerts on everything as far as evo versus go i don't solely post evo versus content but i'm definitely going to keep the community updated as much as i can now so what you're going to want to do is when they have that announcement just follow what they say they're very descriptive and very um very clear in their directions of what to do so just be sure to get in the Discord. Of course, I'll include that link down below as well so you can join the Evo versus Discord. Make sure to have an eye out for the announcements tab in there. They'll post when the contract is ready. They set up about two to three days, I do believe. But I just wanted to come on here today and let you guys know of what to avoid, really. If, if you're already farmed in these farms, remain farming in these farms. Nothing is changing right now. They're still providing emissions. So stay safe in the farms and just farm away that's really my main point of advice here and basically to say we're just awaiting announcement from the team i for one am completely okay with this i want everything to be working working perfectly so there's no issues there's nothing they have to go back and and fix after it's launched and then it just makes for an ugly launch so um all all okay with the delays on my side i hope you guys feel the same but regardless I think a lot of us are hyped for this project. Nothing new to report in the um, app here. Still everything about the same. Still can use WASD. Have not found uh, a key to interact with these people, but um, I did get a message back from, I believe, Olivo or Gilgamesh in the Discord saying that is something they are working on implementing, which is awesome. You can see they're already um, listening to the community and implementing anything they see fit. Um, but that's about it for today's Evo versus video. Hope you guys enjoyed the content here. As always, like I mentioned, follow me on Twitter here. Um, I'll be posting any relevant Evo versus updates and other DeFi crypto updates as well in the space. Um, get me to 50 subscribers. We're halfway there at 33. Uh, I appreciate all the love you guys have shown on my all la on my last videos. Much appreciated. Um, other than that. I hope you guys have a great day in the Evoverse, and I'll see ya.